Jeremy Fowler, ESPN's national football reporter, on what he thinks uh, will be different with the Browns offense in 2023. This is a very popular topic league-wide when I talk to teams about the fit between Watson and Cleveland. Do they mesh? Well, I asked somebody with the team on this, and I was told that they're going to evolve with each other, Stefanski and Watson, that Stefanski is actually eager to experiment, that he isn't put in just a box of having to play a rigid under center, two tight end set formation, that they will mix it up. They'll get it out of shotgun. They'll get it under center. They can run the quarterback off of either run, play action with all of it. I was told Deshaun Watson actually likes playing under center despite his background of shotgun. It's just he was rusty last year. So he's looked a lot better this offseason. They've been really pleased with where he's at in relation to a year ago. They just said once training camp comes, he needs to start to put all that together, which they expect. With that, let's welcome in Brad Ward from the Orange and Brown Report as well as the All Eyes on Cleveland podcast. Brad, I, I, we keep hearing that, and, and I believe it. There is a lot at stake for not only Kevin Stefanski but Deshaun Watson as well. I, I think they both realize they got to get it right, and they got to get it right together. Yeah, they need to be moving in lockstep in this, right? Like, So this feels like uh, Watson has a lot of say in what they're going to do, and that's how it should be, right? And Stefanski, I think you're going to see, you know, uh, less under center. I think you see a lot of shotgun, uh, a lot of gun run, a lot of pistol, a lot of 11 personnel, and a lot of creativity with personnel groupings uh, and more passing. Um, it's the way of the NFL, and in this AFC, you're going to have to be able to score points uh, sometimes at a high rate. And uh, I think that's what – it's interesting. I've always kind of felt that Stefanski has a propensity to want to throw the ball a little bit more. So this is kind of right up his alley as he kind of even tipped his cap to there saying he's uh, interested and intrigued in experimenting with this. So I think this is more of kind of what he wants to do at heart. Yeah, I agree. And I think he's a – I think he is a really good offensive coach. Look, look at the quarterbacks he has had success with. If I'm him, I'm excited to have a guy that can do what Deshaun Watson can do.